Hey Pisces, this is Mystic Virgo. I'm here to do a weekly reading for you all. It is timeless. So please remember to take what you need and leave the rest. For all of you who have contributed to my channel in some way, shape, or form, I, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. My channel is really, really growing. I want to also thank my new subscribers. Please remember you all to like, subscribe if you haven't, and share. This is going to be a weekly reading. It's timeless. So whenever you see it, I hope it resonates with you. So we're going to get started here. I'm also, uh, you all, I'm, I'm, I do have readings available. So if you're interested, check out my about section and that will tell you my price, price range and everything. Okay. Trying to get new equipment for my channel so things can be brighter and bigger for you all. Okay. What messages do I have for my Pisces here? We have the seven of cups, the seven of pentacles and the knight of swords. Something you have a lot of, you have some decisions that you need to make but you're not quite sure if you're making the right decisions. And you really have to come to some kind of decision quick. You have to make up your mind, okay? But you have so much, so many different things that you've thought about, uh, money-wise, uh, things that you want to put out here. Maybe you have some different business ideas or something about growth. You want to, you want things in your life to grow. You don't like being stagnant. You don't like to be stuck in one place. You like to move, move, move like that, that, that gospel song, move mountain, move, 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 having the faith the size of a mustard seed. You can, you can make anything. You can make anything happen. Yes, Pisces can make anything happen, anything grow. You can make stuff grow that other people can't. And that, that's financially everything. That's if you're going out, out to plant some, some, some greens or, or peppers in your yard. Somebody else couldn't make that grow, but you could. You very, very have a great green thumb. There's something about you that... You don't back down. You don't back down. You don't turn your back on anybody either. You're very, very reliable. Okay. But you have to make a decision and you're not sure what you're going to do about it. Okay. Messages for Pisces. Justice. You have to make that decision. Yep. Uh, maybe something about a court situation. Uh, moving or... or <clears throat> excuse me. <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> I got this sage burning. What is going on here? Decisions for the Pisces. Love. I see two of cups. It's an unbalanced situation for you, Pisces. You've worked very, very hard at this relationship. Very hard. Clarify this Knight of Swords. Death. You've worked hard at this relationship. Either you are the person that you're watching for the cross watcher. Okay. Um, somebody needs to make a split decision and leave this relationship. Get a divorce, separate, um, a legal separation or whatever, because it's not balanced. Uh, it's, it's like some, I'm offering you my love. You know, it's just this, this is stuck. The relationship is stuck. It's stagnant. It's not going anywhere. You've planted your seed Pisces, but it's not moving anywhere. It's time to, to let, it's time to let it go. You want changes in your life and this person is not the change that you need for in order for you to grow. Because you grow. You're fine by yourself. I'm sorry about that. You, you're fine by yourself. It's time for you to move forward and away from this relationship. Okay? Just as it's speaking. You know, you care about this person, but it's just not enough. It's just not enough. Okay? Hermit card. Okay? Going on... You have so much going on, but someone here has went into hermit mode. They're shutting it down, closing it down. The office is now closed. Taking that leap of faith. Yep. Shutting it down, Leo. Leo. Maybe you have a Leo here, okay? Or maybe you know somebody by the name of Leo. Le Leon, 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 Leandra, whatever, okay? Three of Cups. Somebody fucking somebody else. Sorry. Give me some overall energy, Pisces. What's the overall energy here for you? The magician. Somebody playing some games. Um, not being fair. Not being fair to you. Okay. You work hard at this relationship. You've done a lot in this relationship. But you ready to call it quits. I'm not going to do this. Hopping. I'm by myself. I'm in hermit mode. You sleep in one room. They probably sleep in another room. They probably sleep on the couch. Probably sleep in the basement on the floor. Who cares? Like another dog. You know. But you're moving away from this relationship. It's not right. It's not balanced. It's not fair. This person who you're kicking it with or who you are in love with or whatever, they're playing a lot of games. Okay. Clarify the three of cups for the Pisces. It's, it's 
it's time to walk away. Somebody's making a decision. I put so much in this relationship. It's not moving. I'm ready to go. I'm taking what I brought in and I'm bouncing. You can take what you have and I'm, we can split the shit down the middle, but I'm done. Okay. Clarify the three of cups for my Pisces here. Walking away. I have the three of wands. You, you're looking back. You probably know about this relationship, this this um, tryst that that your person had, and 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 it's not it's I can't do this anymore, you know. It's like now you're on the outside because you probably already left this relationship, and you're looking back saying, "How did I go through this? Why did I take so long to leave this man alone or to leave this woman alone?" Taking this leap of faith by yourself, refocusing and recalibrating your life so you can start all over again, replanting your seeds for, for growth and for success without this person in your life. You're looking back. I know that they cheated. I'm thinking about this. I found out about it. That ship has sailed. It's time for me to move on with my life. Okay? Have the same map, the same uh, magician energy to move on from this past hurt and pain that this person caused you. Okay? This, this reading may not be for a lot of Pisces, but hopefully if, if you see it, it's for you and it's resonating, okay? I also tend to pick up on past, present, and future energy. So you may look at this two or three months down the line and see that it clicks. I did a reading for someone in November. He finally saw it and it just clicked like last week. So come back and see this and, and maybe save it and tag it or whatever you if, start, if you start having issues with your significant other, okay? And I have prioritized. Focus on your highest priorities. I will help you get organized and uh, motivate. And this is Archangel Metatron. Okay? Being motivated to do things, being motivated to keep growing without this person in your life. This person was holding you back. You're very, very strong and you self-sufficient. So you don't need this person dragging you down. you find by yourself. Let this person be with this trick they were with or however and just be happy by yourself. Messages for the Pisces here. Spiritual understanding. You already know what to do. I am bringing you esoteric information and symbols and helping you understand your spiritual truth. Growing, following your intuition, uh, being highly intuitive. You already know, you already felt that, that your man or woman was cheating on you. You just had to get that confirmation because, look, you went into hermit mode. Searched on the internet. Maybe looked on some cell phones. You found what you were looking for. This jack ass was cheating. And you found out about it. You took that leap of faith and you followed your intuition. You followed your intuition and you found out that this punk, punk ass sucker was cheating. Sorry, but I just feel a lot of, 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 of negative emotions negative feelings words that's not that not have been said that should have been said that kind of stuff like anger you know messages for the pisces here with the ending of this relationship and standing on your own two feet clack look <laughs> clack cognizance pay attention to thoughts and ideas that come to you as they are answered prayers You're getting all this guidance from the universe all the clarity and and the support from the universe that you need all you have to do is tap into your intuition and you did that's why you ended this relationship that's why you ended this relationship messages for pisces life review take inventory of your life and resolve to change or heal anything that is unbalanced that's what you're doing now. You're taking inventory of everything that, that you've been through in your life and in your relationship with this person who is probably your ex. You're taking inventory, paying attention to everything they've said and everything you've done. And you know you got to work, you got some work to do. Here. You've got some work to do, and you're doing everything that you need to do. You're reviewing your life and what you want. You're reviewing your life purpose. What is it that you need to do? You need to continue to grow without this person in your life without this person stealing your thunder you can do it you can do bad by yourself and you can do damn good by yourself too pisces two more cards you want to close you out messages for the pisces queen of cups now it's time for you to refocus on yourself focus on your feelings how you're wanting to do how you want to put yourself out there because you can do it you can do it all that, you're still in your feelings and in your emotions, but that's going to change. But that's okay. Move on and move up. 
Oh, I clear your space. I saw this card when I first took it out the box. Clear your space, okay? Get rid of clutter. Clear the energy around you and use feng shui. Clear the clutter. Talk to yourself. Say some good things, sweet things to yourself. Say you over that, that jackass who broke your heart. Let him go pack his shit and clear your space and make that feng shui comfortable for you. Clear his shit. Tell him to go. Tell her to go however, you know? Clear your space. Take their toxic stuff away cleanse it get you some sage i'm burning some sage right now before the reading i used some white sage and i cleared the, the area uh so go ahead and sage your area clear your space and clear your mind and start all over again because you can do it I, when i first started this reading for you the first thing i felt is that is that you can you have the possibility to grow so much very very grounded uh not wanting to end things or lose things but sometimes we have to end things to get better things but i just see you being so so grounded and and, and being able to to thrive and grow so you're going to grow you're not going to stop growing because this person person broke your heart just got to keep on put that put your foot in the ground put your uh put his ass out her and whoever and do what you need to do for you because you can do it it's within you, you just got to let go of the dead weight okay